Hey yo, what's up? It's your boy Jack again. Let me talk about something that is very important for our young men, especially our little boys. We must, te we must teach them to value winning, to win, not to be complacent, not to be okay with losing. And why I say that is, I got my boys in the sports, and overwhelmingly I hear from a lot of men, it doesn't matter if you win or lose, as long as you have fun. What? No, it does matter if you win. And I'll explain why. Life does not work like that. You know, if you're competing with somebody for a job and you lose, doesn't matter if you if you win or lose, as long as you try it. No, you won't eat. You know, if you are competing for a female's affection and you lose, it doesn't matter if you win or lose, everything will turn out okay. No, you won't be married. You know that if you have to fight somebody to protect your family, it doesn't matter if you win or lose as long as you really give it your all. No, you got to win because the protection and the safety of your family depends on it. The real world does not work like that. And we need to start teaching young men, yeah, it's okay to be competitive and have your fun and stuff, but you must value winning. Don't be complacent being a loser. It's too many men in their mom's basement wondering why they can't get no girl's affection, wondering why they can't achieve things in life because they don't value winning. They don't think it's important to win. They think it's important just to go through life and act like everything is okay. Well, I'm trying. Your trying does not matter to the world. You can try as much as you want, and if somebody is stronger than you, better than you, faster than you, that stronger, better, faster person is going to win and you're going to lose. So what do you do? You make yourself the best person you can be. Even the Bible compares itself when it talks about the Christian walk. talks about you are more than conquerors. Talk about running the weight race marked out for you. Talking about being a warrior, putting on the armor of God, winning a battle. You have to win. You have to look at life as a battle that you cannot lose. Too many men are walking around in this world thinking that life is going to be easy. Stuff just going to be given to them that they are entitled. Even some of the fe feminist mantras that people talk about, some of them are true. Men will walk around and think they are entitled to a woman's body. And they're a loser. They watch too much porn. They think women are just going to throw themselves at them. And they're losers. And they're not doing anything to make themselves better. I'm not saying that the market is good out here. We'll talk about that later in the week. I'm going to try to do a long video on that this week. It's going to be good. The market is not good. The dating market. But let me tell you something. If you are okay with being a loser, if you have been taught that you can just play the game of life, and that no matter what the outcome, you've tried your best, you got to try harder. You got to work harder. You got to be better. Stronger. I'll tell you something about my life that has always affected me. I'm not the smartest person. I'm not the most talented person. I have many talents. People who know me know me. I have plenty of hobbies, whether it's art, whether it's dance, whether it's communication, public speaking. I have a lot of talents, but I've never been the best at any of those talents. I've never been the best, but I've always worked harder than those who were doing the same thing competing with me. Always. So that's what made me be able to achieve what I've achieved. And that's why I think I'm going to go further in the future. I don't look at life as, well, you know, this is just what I have. I'm okay with being where I'm at right now. No, I'm always competing. That doesn't mean being envious of others. We can talk about that too. You can look at another man and say, man, I want what he has. He shouldn't, he doesn't deserve that. I deserve it. Or you can say, man, that dude worked hard. What did he do to get where he is? I'm happy that I've achieved what I've achieved, but I see that he's working hard and he's achieved what he's achieved. What can I learn from that man? How can I compete? And then when you get on his level, you compete with him in a friendly competition. Oh, I see him doing that. I'm going to step my game up too. That's how men are supposed to do. Too many weak men are sitting around expecting things to be given to them. Go out and make it for yourself.